How amazing! As I said, let's do the star seed and when I press the recording, the sunshine is going out, even it was raining for fully 20 days here in Australia, Sydney. So the topic is, are you a star seed? And if you are, what are you doing here? And do you have a job? So this is my seven stars lifestyle and I help people raise their frequency so they can uh, achieve the higher realms of existence right here and right now. So I would like to start, I'm going to cover like the, the signs that you know that you are a star seed and all that goes along with that with my unique view as always. So uh, what's really important to start with uh, understanding the type of times that we are here and you need here because if you are a star seed that tells you exactly that you are a star seed so you came here from the higher realms of existence right that means that you are uh, higher in consciousness in order to for you to to come over here you needed to descend and incarnate and you know do this regular human life so the reason for that is actually these times that we are living in and these are the the darkest of the darkness time on the on earth so these are the end times it's like the like the end night and uh, this is where uh, majority of people where um, how do you call it collective collective mind is totally unconscious totally unconscious so um, from the opposite side you know once upon a time you know there was a pure consciousness there was less consciousness and you know there was less and less consciousness and now it's people are totally unconscious you know the evil is prevailing and you know uh, everything that was good it's bad now it's the, the bad things are ruling um, you know the bad things are legal and this kind of stuff you know it, like this is this this upside down universe that I'm talking about so there is so much contrast there is so much um, duality and this is exactly why this is the most beneficial time for every single soul to ascend you know this is why there is so many of us so many billions of people because they all can uh, 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 the people can only ascend through this period through this uh, high polarity this uh, uh, big duality so um yeah that that's 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 enough I don't want to go further that that rabbit hole. So, this is a Kali Yuga. So, this is why this is why the star seeds came to the earth because. Uh, so you need to understand that if you're a star seed, you already ascended. So you already came from the higher realms to earth, and you came uh, to be a service to humanity. You came here literally to help. But, you know, like in a universe, everything is always a two-way street. It's not just me helping you. It's always a mutual, mutual uh, benefit, like whatever you're doing. This is, this is how the right uh, connections, right things are always, you can see they are mutual. When I'm talking to you, this conversation is flowing. The energy is flowing and energy is coming back. It's, it's recharging. This is, this is how the real uh, uh, things, the, the, the things that are of the high, highest order, uh, order work so what's important to understand so these star seeds you know uh, they volunteer and they they came you know for this specific time because you know they trusted themselves you know they're going to be able to remember who they are and you know do the things that they need to do and then serve the others that they need to serve so they also uh, uh, came and done depends you know from person to person how many lives but they needed to descend and they uh, they they took the will on karma and everything else. So, at this time, uh, but again, you know, for them it's so much uh, easier uh, to remember. It's easier for them because they already they already ascended. So, the thing is, you know, that um, the 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 thing that that is most telling for you to understand to to actually be sure that you are a star seed. Uh, is uh, the, the sign that uh, you are someone that was always wondering, that was always thinking about, you know, like what's life, you know, why I'm here, what's my purpose, you know, like what's in the stars, how can be something infinite, what is God, you know, those 
those people that are constantly, uh, you know, seeing the bigger picture, those people that are, you know, for that reason, are not so fitting in because they cannot fit in this uh, unconscious world that we live in present, this dark world that we, we can see now everywhere, you know, which is fine, right? Again, this is why we came for, this is like the, um, uh, how do you call it? Like a season finale, <laughs> you know, like... The, <laughs> this is why you came for this is game on my dear star seed. so if you always been different you know this is why so um, so you came here uh, basically to assist humanity but because you took the birth and you know you went through this <laughs> karmic process and all of it so you also, uh, you know, get on karma and things and you also brought up in a, in a regular world and you got so conditioned and, and uh, programmed the wrong way. So the first part for you is, you know, to, rem to remember who you are is to, is to uh, clear out the ego. It's, it's to, to do that uh, necessary work on yourself because you have a mission to fulfill. And, you know, like it, this, uh, you being a star seed is not something like, oh, I'm a star seed. Oh, how cool. I'm a star seed. No, because you came here with a mission. You already sent it, but maybe with the, this mission, you're going to go even to the higher realms or, you know, God knows where in the universe, which planes of existence. So, uh, so you literally came, what they say, uh, you know, you, you are a beacon of light because you are a beacon of light. You're literally how I see the star seed are like those pillars and you know, those pillars like everywhere are around the world and you're like a transmuter, transmitter and transmuter, you know, connected to the, connected to the skies, connected to the earth and you are transmuting things and like uh, you are, you are influencing people uh, with your, with your vibration, with your, with your uh, uh, frequency uh, and it is, it is as you have a specific message, you have a specific gift, you have a specific mission that you came here to radiate and help others to come into your field. This is why, you know, in the early stages, it's, it's very uh, telling if you are someone that, that people are naturally drawn to, that people come for advice, that people trust, that people feel uh, sacred and space in, in, in your world. If people uh, know that you are an honest person, if people know that they can rely on you, that, they are, they are, that you are providing that uh, safe space for them, you know, that's pure benevolence, this is who you are. You will notice that people that are, that have, that are, um, star seeds they have this uh, amazing ec expanding um expanding inviting field you know feel that that is balancing a field that that uh, that um that that you feel something that's drawing to you to that to that uh to that person i'm not talking about uh, charismatic people you know because uh <laughs> devil can be very <laughs> charismatic as well so but it's like uh, the first part, so first part of, of Star Seed's life, you know, is to recognize that, you know, to understand that you haven't just come for, uh, just for a regular life, you know. Uh, the reason that you are asking, the reason that you are seeking, the reason that you can see there is a reason and there is, a, and there is some other person right next to you that can't see a thing, you know, there is a reason it was given to you to see this because then by you realizing this opening your unique gifts, unique talents, then you you can be that bacon for light for people that are similar to you that are going to resonate with you uh that you know that 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 you're gonna be that a little you know uh, a beacon of light again you know that that's gonna make them make them see you know start them see because this is their chance this is the last chance this this, this times it's really you know uh Go, go big or go home, you know, or you're gonna wait for another uh, cycles of 26,000 years, I think it is, doesn't matter, you know, but knowing that this is the end times and, you know, that, that what you do right now, it really matters, you know, so, and to hurry up with uh, 
understanding there are so many videos around there you know that you can see the signs that you are a, a star seed you already know this and you know this is why you see so many people what's my mission what's my mission what's my mission it's a process right because you need to clear out all the all the karma you need to clear all the programs everything else you know to stabilize so you can actually be the best you can be and then you know to start to work on others so um so that's that's one of the most telling signs if you are someone that's uh that's uh always been asking about the god and you know like it doesn't matter what happened in, in your life you always been you know um you have always been trying to connect you know you always wanted to you know you go you went for the readings you you know you 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 are thinking how to talk to your spirit guides you know you are just yearning for for that that connection you know it doesn't matter what happened you know life happens to everyone but you always kept that uh connection to god you know? and this is the only way because you you keep that connection to god and then eventually you're gonna click totally fully when it's your time it's like a wheel when it clicks and it's your time and you your gifts going to open you know when you when you come to the certain point when you when you clear out enough of humanness inside you and uh your gifts going to open your voice going to open it's going to be the time and place for a specific mission and and don't be fooled you know the where you are right now in the world this is exactly where you where you need to be because there is also a specific like those pillars that i see around the world you know we are everywhere and we are equally everywhere you know and like my tribe you know it's here or you know like the, the tribe is going to going to find me around the internet you know they're going to be attracted to something that that i that i have to offer you know so this is uh your specific gifts and talents they open up and you going to help specific people that need exactly what you offer you know you have that uh, you have that missing puzzle uh, for them uh, to get them on the journey to give me to give them another uh, a puzzle so they can so they can move past some uh, hurdle you know some program so it's so it's not just you know for fun that you are uh, <laughs> Star seed and uh, but there is some work to do so you know what's really important that you do this work on yourself so you can have your own guidance because this is not something that you gonna be uh, you know you can uh, you can recognize star seeds because they are totally unique and most of the things that they do you know they can be okay educated on some on some level but mostly what they do is coming from the inside you know the answers are revealed from inside they claim their ancient gifts the the, the things are revealed to them and they're having a totally unique perspective and this is how you're going to know that this is this is a, a star seed so so you do have a a, a unique set of skills and talents right and uh, you just have to it's it's like you know you're going through the life and all the things that you picked up and all the things that you that you learn and then when it's time you you're like ha huh, all of those gifts you know this is when you work with god all of those things and skills and everything that i've been learning from and then this uh wisdom comes from inside and you you just uh you just uh connect all the dots and you say oh this is what i meant to do like because you can you could see you could see uh, so many star seeds like what's my passion what's my passion like what's my purpose what's my because they know that they, they came here for a purpose they already figured it out but it's a process because firstly they need to embody that frequency they need to be themselves they, they need to find this to do that necessary work on themselves so and you know in the right time it, everything is just going to click everything is going to open and uh, they're gonna be on their uh, mission on their journey you know and they was like they they, be, they 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 would be like oh my god but i knew this all my life you know it was right in front of my nose it's usually like that so you know don't run to ask others what's your mission but go inside and ask yourself because it's probably right in front of you it's the things that you are mostly interested about you know that you just love doing you know this is your mission this is what you're gonna do so it's like it can be any kind of profession but you're doing something specifically or, or with with your own view with your own perspective you know like like with, with what i'm sharing this is totally my perspective totally 
totally what I believe it's it's uh, it's 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 the star seed journey and uh, the responsibility of of you know if you came here to help so so the star seeds they always knew they came you know like, like since you've been little you know you knew that you came here for something big but you know the the whole world around you doesn't tell you uh, you know that you you come here to do something big you know and this is this is why you are on that quest on, on searching and 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 journeying you know because you are actually chasing to find this big greatness because you feel that you know but and in the same time you can't expect from this unconscious world to tell you you know what's your mission you need to find yourself to do the work on yourself and then to be of service to others that's that was the whole point you coming here so so you are like you are if you are a star seed your job is you know to be here and shine like a sun to share your wisdom to share what you learn to uh, like the like the sun is shining and it's not expecting anything in return this is pure benevolence this is why you came here this is what people what makes you happy you know this is this uh service to the world right and uh just being there just showing up for people and uh, holding that space for them you know uh, 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 believing in them they're gonna they're gonna you know see they're gonna you know try to they're gonna start on their journey of ascension and uh, use this opportunity because you can see how many billions of people are right here and they came here for this show for this time so So your specific time, your, your specific path, you know, how you've been led to, it's telling you so much about it. So, so star seeds are, I mean, like you would not find someone that is a star seed if it's a close minded. No, 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 no. You just can't, you, that's just impossible. You know, so someone can be totally, you know, not knowing anything about spirituality, whatever, you know, like, but I have so many people that, you know, uh, 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 that are just regular people, but they're open and, you know, they're, they, they are open to listen. They are open to expand, you know, they're, you know, because they can be a young souls and who knows. So, but the star seed are always open minded, uh, since birth, they always been exploring, exploring, learning new things. What else is there for me? You know, they couldn't, they're just different. Like you just know you're different and that's it. You are different. And then you start to, you know, they all want to put you in that box, but you know, by certain time you give yourself a break and you say, Oh my God, I love that I'm unique. And I like that I'm uh, different. So the star seats are teachers, teachers, of the unique knowledge of the you have the unique knowledge unique unique code not something that you learn mainstream but something that comes from within something that comes uh, as a result of your result of your um, of your life result of your first hand experience something that you've been contemplating something that that you connected the dots and then that you are sharing with others because this becomes your truth so so you will you will see that um star seeds are pretty wise and uh, they have a lot to share because you know their interest is 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 also uh much uh, uh, much higher so so the other thing is that if you are a star see that people are naturally drawn to you yes so they feel safe with you and uh this is how uh we are naturally wired in our dna uh every single life is going it's it's wired towards the sun it's wired towards the towards the highest highest frequency this is this is why so why it's really important that you do the work on yourself you know because you have to you have to uh you have to embody your highest frequency so you basically have to ascend in this realm here in order to call in your tribe so 
when you do this you have a specific frequency that then it's like a, then it's like a, a signal for others that like your call goes out and you actually you are actually able to uh, to lead their life so you you need to lead yourself first to, to become that to clear out everything you know so your 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 life force is it's it's high and you you are lit like a candle and uh light is in you you embody light you embody your highest frequency and then when you do that then you can uh, uh go and lead other people i take a, a big responsibility in what i teach and you know i've been uh i've been in total isolation for for, for last four or five years you know because I'm I'm someone that work uh, that done 20 years work on myself and the last 10 are amazingly you know important and the last 5 it's it's just another level in solitude and you know really uh, uh opening and working with my gifts and you know because it's easy to add information to the noise but you actually if you come here you want to take the responsibility because what you do you want to make sure that you do good, that you do for the good cause, that you do for the life, for, for the light. It's easy to uh, add to the noise and, you know, just to be copycat and repeat, repeat information. People need your truth. If you are a star seed, people need your truth. For example, you can be a, 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 a star seed if you, and, and express this through your photography, for example, you know, but you have to be uh, uh, clear enough, clean enough, so your photography, you know, is going to be something that your your tribe is going to see and something that 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 that, that photo is going to uh, uh, spark something in them, you know, like there are many, many ways, but you know, that's going to be some unique photography. It's not going to be the wedding photography, for example, you know what I mean? But, but there are so many, so many ways that you can be a star, that you can uh, uh, do this work that you came here for and lead people and like, uh, like through photography, through music, through, you know, but first, the first part it's you finding yourself because you you because you haven't just came here from the from the sky and say hi I'm a star seed and I remember everything. No, you have to go through this grind in order you know to do the work to understand your fellow humans. You know to understand more of who you are and how you progress. This is how you share with others. This is how you just hold this frequency so that so the humanity as a whole uh, 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 can uh, can ascend can go to the high rounds so <sighs> what would I yes and you would also see you know people say this uh they call them uh, I call them power couple they they call them uh, what's the name Mm, twin flames but this is as well uh this is like a like first and foremost you have to work on yourself to be a a, a self-sufficient battery unit charger you know and then when you're self-sufficient and you're beaking that light and you're lifting the people up uh then is then you can actually meet your twin flame they call it you know that the power couple so you will see power couples twin flames but these are the two two star seeds that are totally completely complete on their own and they, they come to a company together and they usually and you can see this in so many examples usually they have the same mission so they she gonna do something he's gonna do something but then uh combined their their mission is even bigger you know so it's like you being mono and then with your partner you're going you're going to be a stereo i also believe that this has to be a uh, female and male because this is again this balance divine ma masculine and feminine which is also that needs to be mastered in us uh and then that's shown all around so this is this is what i what i've got for you 
uh, that I believe that is really important uh, for star seeds to know and you know to take your job seriously and you know to really give yourself a, a, a peck on the back and credit and really see you know like look at your life you know and 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 just solve the puzzle solve the puzzle uh, clear out your feel and and so that you can actually uh, start with your mission and helping people and uh, do what you came here to do so with best wishes, speak soon.